Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Nur Hidayah from class 3B. Now I'm going to talk about the positive things during distance learning. During the COVID-19 pandemic, the education system in Indonesia implemented distance education. So, as the students and teachers, of course, we have to learn from home. Electronic learning or online learning is the part of distance education that specifically combines electronic technology and internet-based technology. So, in my opinion, there are several benefits that we can get from this distance learning system for students and teachers. The first, increase the ability to use technology. This is the most important because basically at this time all students and teachers are learn from home and then of course they have to uh, using the technology such as computer, laptop and smartphone for uh, learning. And the Deputy Region of Jember, Dr. Andes K. Haji Ahmad Mukit Arif said, in the past, teachers, parents, and children who use the gadget just to play, but now they use gadget for useful things such as learning. Next, the internet usage becomes more productive. Why is it productive? Because usually we use the internet just for media social like Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and many more. But right now, all of us using the internet for learning. Unlike in general class, uh, with this distance learning, we can be more uh, creative in learning. Teachers and students can be work together in determining uh, the most creative method possible. The chairperson of Indonesian National Commission for UNESCO, Arif Rahman, said, Many online learning can accessed by students, so is that can help them deepen their materials via uh, webinars, uh, Zoom, and learning being monitored directly by parents are the benefits of distance learning. Next, distance learning can save our expenses for studying. Is it the true? Distance learning can save our cost? Yeah, I have felt it. Usually, uh, by offline learning or face-to-face, -face, we have to prepare our cost for transportation and meals. But right now, we don't need it. Of course, we can save our cost. Next, flexible study hours. When we study at schools or a campus, we usually spend quite a lot of time, around 8 or uh, 10 hours per day. But with distance learning, of course, we always uh, stay at home with our family. And then every day, we can do uh, many things while learning. And then those are the positive things, in my opinions, we can get during uh, the distance learning. So many things uh, that are useful during the implementations of distance learning from home for students and teachers. Distance learning also uh, teach us many things that we didn't know before. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.